Key Will Office of Government Services, where he rents a lot of his space to the government. I would prefer to see money spent to develop the, to help all the people of Erie County. I think, I was thinking about that in the shower this morning. I'm thinking of all the things at my job. I work full time. Uh, I work with kids in schools, graduating from high school, and they can't find jobs. <coughs> they get some skills in the schools. What we're lacking is, and I know we're not supposed to promote other ideas, maybe, I don't know, but we like to have, I would love to see um, programs, on-the-job training types of programs, maybe develop an apprenticeship program where kids can come out of the schools and have apprenticeships in different areas like welding, sheet metal work, things like that. We don't have that in this area. We have employers willing to hire, but we don't have the training here. I don't know if you're into having training facilities, but I'm sure a lot of businesses, small businesses and, and corporations, could give you the space and the, the development to have people in internships so that they could later be hired. Something like that that would benefit the people of Erie County, not just a couple of people and result in some minimum wage jobs that are gonna last a short period of time. And it may not even be new jobs. And if you do give this money to Paladino, um, or to any developer, whatever project you have, get it in writing how many jobs and how much they're gonna pay. Not minimum wage, but real living wage. Something like 12, 15, $20 an hour mm. types of uh, pay. And that's about all I have to say about it. Okay. Any other speakers? I'll speak. I've got one over here, Chip. I'll be brief. I'll be brief. I'll be brief. I'm Chuck Cohen. I'm tired. Uh, it just kind of irks me that uh, the city would be talking about cutting NFTA jobs uh, and services for people who don't have cars or just use uh, public transportation, and then giving hundreds of thousands of dollars to a person really that doesn't need it. Uh, I've heard, and I haven't verified this, but I've heard that very often Mr. Palladino would uh, get these tax breaks and then not follow through on, on the uh, job hiring that he represented uh, that he do. So I would, I would uh, urge this uh, uh, very county industrial development agency to, to kind of scrutinize, to take a, a different look at, at these applications and what they, what they apply for the community. Because it seems that monies that couldn't that is spent on being uh, given to people who don't really need it, which is kind of going on in a lot of other places, too. Thank you. Any other speakers?